everybody, thanks for watching. I'm here with Monty Shinebloom there in the shadows. Uh, we have been talking about the short game recently. We haven't done a lot of short game videos, and we're getting more into it because how important is the short game? Just a little. It's a little important. And the so. irony, the irony is, is you know, I I learned so much about it watching, you know, 150 hours at tour events and solving my own issues that mm -hmm. um, people have. I've become more more popular as a short game instructor. And it's pretty ironic being a long drive champion. Yeah. More people come to me for short game. Yeah. And you see a lot of good before and afters with your students. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Short game muscle. Yeah. We're gonna do something kind of fun here and just let you guys kind of uh, tag along. Monty and I are gonna play a game of horse. So the game is this: uh, horse. Uh, the person that hits it further away gets a letter. The first one to spell horse loses. And the stakes are uh, about. Zilch for me and uh, everlasting shame for Monty if he loses. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm actually, I used to be a really, really good short game player. Recently, uh, well, not recently, in the last two years, it's kind of gone away. Okay, I'm pointing, yeah, all right, let's see what you got. Okay, that wasn't too bad. That was just a little bit too long of a swing for that shot. All right, guys, so I'm sitting about a little less than six feet away. Oh, and you just played it totally differently than me. Shit, rolled out. I know, that was, it was looking like it was going to be about I, two I, feet, but... I thought it checked a little more. I think I got you by about six inches. Or maybe not. Let's see. One and two... Yeah, I got you by a little bit. One and two. You think so? Yeah. Let's do the stick. We're going to be sticklers here. <laughs> That's all right. I could be wrong. Okay. There's that. Uh, you got me by about half a ball. See, sometimes, like George W. Bush, you got to go to a recount to get your victory. Oh, I already feel shame. <laughs> no, right. Maybe I should have hit the the long swing drop kick spinner instead of you know. At least I'm you would have gotten style points. Exactly right. Let's go to that that. There's a wacky pin there, guys. That's like over that bunker, all the way up there to the left, kind of okay, kind of far. And this lie, as you guys can see, there's not much grass here. So this is definitely would be a nightmare shot for me normally. Oh no! Rejected. Just you, you, you know missed it by a little see, bit. See, you know I don't I don't even care. Yeah. I mean that was really well played. <laughs> yeah. You know you didn't. I hit it good. Yeah. You didn't get narrow on it. See again, I, you know I lost by a ball length on the last one, but had I hit those two shots individually if I was practicing, yeah, I would have hated the one that you hit right. and liked the one that I hit. Yeah. Because I hit it correctly. I hit it a little too hard. Big yeah. deal. Mm -hmm. That one, you hit it five feet not hard enough, but the execution was good. Yeah. Learning proper distance control. You learn the proper technique, but you learn the proper distance control just from playing more golf. Yep. So, Regardless of whether I'm better, worse, the same as what you did, to me, you, you won this one, too. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. Good shot, Monty. Very good. All right, so it's H to H, and it's Monty's choice here. we got to go retrieve our balls from... Here, just leave it in the bunker. Okay. Bunker shots. This is an area we haven't covered. Dark as a dungeon in here. So there's Monty's ball. That was a very tough shot, and he has about, he hit it to about five steps, about 15 feet. It's almost impossible to get close to that pin, because if you barely hit it over the bunker, it runs through the green. you got to fly it past. All right, we're in this bunker. This is nice sand, too, I can feel. Oh, really nice, Monty. Sound was great. Regardless of the outcome, that you're happy with that, right? Uh, you're in trouble. Oh, no. That's about a foot away. Did you point to it with the camera? No. Okay, guys, Monty's about a foot away. 
I'm really not thinking much different here as far as my, my pitching. My it's, it's the same pitching. as a regular pitch. You're just opening the face to expose more bounce in the bunker. Okay. That's what opening the face does. Exposes more bounce. Okay, gotcha. Oh, no. See, and that's... That, that, that was so off the toe. Well... I'm a big, bu I, I, I know a lot of people teach steep in the bunker. Yeah. I teach be even shallower in the bunker because then you're not, you know, at the mercy of how much sand is in the trap. What did I do to make that? Oh, there? total float load, yank the handle. D exactly. Okay. I mean, it wasn't as bad as what you just demonstrated, so let me but yeah. really concentrate on getting this whole unit. And really, forward. really hit up, yeah. so to speak. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. See, that was still steep, but you got a result. You rolled it all the way down the hill, even almost got inside of me. Okay. Oh, that was a great shot, Monty. All right, Monty is very, very close. Here. Eight inches? Yep. All right. All right, still Monty's turn. I'm, I have, I'm on H-O, and Monty is on H. You're a hoe. I'm a hoe. Okay, so here's another shot that everybody can learn a little bit from. I mean, we could putt this. Because the, the fringe is, the fringe is, you know, we could just dink it down the hill. But let's try and learn something. All right, pretty dark. So it's hard to tell slope on video, guys, but we're we are on yeah, downslope. on a downslope and here. All you do is you try, you know, if you came in shallow with a normal stance, you're going to hit in the hill behind the ball. Yeah. Because the, the back part is higher. Yeah. So you just get in there, get your shoulders more aligned with the slope, and theoretically try and do, you know, the same thing. Got a little too much on it. Okay. About six, eight feet past. Now, am I allowed to cheat here? And blade it? No. And, yeah. And, no. And, and do a left hand low blade shot. I got it. I got it. Actually. No, you got you got to hit it the way. Yeah, I know. I know. Trying to get you on a technicality here. And again. All right, stance wise. So it's it's on the downhill. I feel like I want to put it in the back of my. No, 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 no. Yeah. Play it normal yeah. and just tilt your shoulders with the hill. And this is a little, I mean, it's, I don't know what the camera's going to show. It's pretty dark. And, and I was happy with the shot that I hit. I just hit it too hard. See, it, and you're going to get a better result, but, um, you float know, loaded a little bit. you float loaded and you dropped your right shoulder and, okay. you know, you didn't get the shoulder forward. Okay. And you know what? That, that was the wrong shot. It, the shot that we had, we could have so, taken out a putter and kicked it. Yeah, right. Results-wise, uh, I got lucky there. So we're both a couple of hoes here, playing horse. We're both on HO, and let's go into a little bit of the brighter light, and I'll, I'll choose just to uh, have all different kinds of shots to hit here. We're going to put this one here above our feet. Whenever the ball's above your feet, you want to get a little bit further from it, just like when the ball's below your feet, you get a little closer. Or you can choke up. Or not both. You can do both. Okay, yeah. All right, so I'm going to this first one here. Tough shot. Oh, that was so good. I hit it a yard too short and it kicked. How'd you like that technique there, Monty? Well, you know, you're, you're, you're kind of not getting your right shoulder forward. I gotcha. And, yeah. Uh, you, drop kicked every every ball so far you've hit a little bit behind it yes that's the my nephew saying it's a little duffy right so and and you know that's what i'm saying you know if you're if your intent is good you get away with a little bit of of nastiness okay gotcha yeah just having the intent of being forward is is right. yeah all right so i'm sitting there about nine feet either you beat me again okay so Monty's landed here and ran that way that, that honestly I deserve to lose that one that was the first one that I hit poorly okay that was a uh, legitimately bad that was shot. terrible okay my choice so Monty's a whore h-o-r and uh, not a whore like you guys are thinking like a whore like an hors d'oeuvre and uh, I am a hoe just in case we missed some of this on my my GoPro we're playing a, a game of horse, Monty and I, and we've had a really great discussion about the short game. And it's, we're down to Monty has H-O-R-S, I have H-O-R, and he just hit it to 
How many feet on this shot? I don't know, four or five maybe. Oh gosh, all right. Oh, maybe, you know, it's a little bit long. It's about eight feet. All right, my take I mean, is to eight feet. I there, mean, there's, the, the pin is barely over the lip of that bunker and it's a down slope. Okay. That was really good, Brendan. I think you're gonna get hose though. Yeah, I think I got a hard bounce there, Monty. I was the winner. I, that that one was I was at four steps away, and Monty was like four steps and a couple inches away. So uh, the first, the real lesson though is I was a little fat, a little duffy on the first couple letters of the game, but because my intention was right, was better. My my it, my it, results were okay. Your yeah. results were good, and you know you hit soft shots, and sometimes those little bit of drop kicks. When, when you're doing it well, they they kind of manage themselves. Yeah. And, um, and you know, you hit good shots. But the, the, they were a little duffy or a little a little ch chubby and not hit right. Mostly, you think, because the right... This not whole, mostly, all of it. All of it, because this right arm, shoulder, everything of this right arm was Didn't not like getting forward. forward. And yeah. your, your swing bottom was too far back. Okay. And that's that's the when you first start learning to come in shallow and use the bounce. Yeah. Coming in a little bit behind the ball. See, but there, there's a huge difference between coming in a hair behind the ball steep where you're leading yeah. with the leading edge mm -hmm. and a hair behind the ball coming in shallow where you got the bounce coming in. It's amazing to me how extreme that this wide to wider feeling had to be. Right. And and you're like like I said this one, uh, the one the one shot we hit I don't think my GoPro captured it but I said uh, damn the torpedoes I'm just gonna try to go do this motion this correct way and if it's fat whatever you know because neither of us really cared if we won or lost but um, the the impact was perfect right uh, how prevalent do you think this is for amateur golfers as far it's as almost universal. wide to narrow it's almost universal okay it's almost universal and and. You know, you see a lot of guys that people will make fun of their emotions. Oh, yeah. dude, you're a scooper. How do you get it up and down from everywhere? Yeah. Well, they're not scoopers. They're actually putting pretty good technique on it. They're just not leaning. You're not supposed to lean the shaft in the short game. Yep. It's, not, it's not a coincidence. If your GoPro didn't get it, your worst shot was in the bunker where, in my opinion, you needed to be even wider. I'm not real big on yeah. being narrow. Mm -hmm. I know yeah. a lot of people teach that. Um, you got real narrow, you left it in the bunker over that high lip. I got super, super wide and hit it up there, you know, about eight inches. Yep. T to me, that's an easier and more consistent way to do it. It's a good practice prescription, too, to go into the bunkers and hit some really wide to wide, especially because bunkers are a great chance to get the feeling of impact without having to hit a ball. Correct. Yeah. Correct. All right, guys, so uh, thanks for watching. Uh, Monty has a short game video all about this at montysheinbloom.com and um, which is a, a lot more in depth and he's at youtube.com slash hit it long and uh, subscribe to this channel too. be better golf later bye